G'day, today we're playing Tiny Topia again, and this time we're going to have a go at the level of Fledgling Fields. Uh, build a relaxed residential community and learn the basics of building a community. Sounds, sounds pleasant. So I imagine we're not going to be hit with too much in the way of disasters yet. Okay. Split special building, build a tier 3 store, reach 1,000 citizens with 50% happiness. People 50% happiness is one of my specialties. Okay, if you may want to deal with the job situations, it's not enough work. Make a tier 2 store by merging two tier 1 stores. Alright, so if we just put one beside it, easy enough. Doing that wrong? Is that the right store? Is that the shop? I should have done the. Yeah, mixed them up. Those are my houses, these are my stores. I'm certain this is the house it's showing me, isn't it? So that's that blueprint. Or was I just clicking on the wrong thing? In front of. Oh, goodness, alright. Head in the game. It's still the house. There we go. Great. Now cancel your selection by pressing that. Let's go bigger, make tier 3. Point the cursor over it so we need to do the same thing again, but just do it on top. Voila. Get back to paying their taxes. Alright, so it's a tier 3 store done. Nice and easy. Now you want to reach 1,000 citizens, which seems like a pretty big goal. Yeah. Alright. So what I guess we want to do is... um. Goal tasks, where's the secondaries? So the secondary, the last secondary goal is a mere challenge meant to push your skills to their limits. Alright, so I guess it's the challenge. So there's no point in just trying to do the main goal here. We'll try and do the secondary ones as we go. So let's try and expand our houses. Now let's have a look at our second one. So at this point, what we can do is then build oh, depth perceptions a bit off there. Uh, what can we do? We can rotate around. Put two behind it. Great. And so then just the same thing again on top. So let's get a um, fire station put in here as well, somewhere where, I mean, it's questionable placement there. Can I move it? I mean, no one seems to be objecting to it just sitting on the road, so this guy's not happy. Do I need a hospital? Let's call an ambulance in there. Power. Okay, so we want power. Coal plant. Great. Ambulance. Steep medical bill. Okay, so now what we'll do is we'll get a road to connect these guys over here. They want jobs, so we will... Yeah, my 
my depth perception is definitely struggling with uh, this one. So let's flip that around and... Now the interesting thing is that the jobs don't really uh, seem to have a requirement level. Okay, so you can see there's work available but not necessarily work is required, like it, I guess it's not going to suffer if um, there aren't the amount of workers needed to get depth perception, man. I'm never going to get this, I don't think. It feels like I'm putting it behind it. Feels like the part is sitting back there, but I guess not. Why am I building offices? I don't want offices, I want houses. A quick comment on these classy houses versus those offices, they look very similar. Okay, so the special building is now available. Oh, someone called the ambulance. The building's failed me again. Okay, so. Uh, cool. So the ambulance can sort out something that far away. Happiness is getting better. Uh, recreation. I probably don't want to build too close to these places because um, we want to be able to expand the houses out a bit more. So let's try building one of these houses because we don't have any of these yet. And we'll build across the road. This might make it easier for me if it's already facing away. Okay, so not on top. So there's no real... I, mean, I can't quite tell what the rhyme or reason is for the roads. Like how close to a road do you need to be to be satisfied with, with an adjacent road? That's our happiness level reached in this one. I mean, my happiness is, is probably sitting at about 50% as well with this fire station sitting on the road. Uh, oh, look at some farms. Provides a population bonus. Do you anything special with those guys? Are they sort of set as they're, as they're built? What are you saying there? Two houses in front, okay. Glad he accepted that placement. Let's go, this is a mess over here. Potentially like having this built as a bit more of a grid uh, might be more, might have been a bit more suitable for it because it does seem like I'm uh, you can just be off, and I wouldn't. I wouldn't mind with it uh, being a bit more forgiving in, in in correcting your mistakes. Okay, so we're up to two fifty. Again, we can build back of this place. I'm building the wrong type of house there, though. Can I get rid of a house? Oh, that was something in the last one, wasn't it? Removaling? Removaling. Oh. It was, I've already forgotten how. It must not spawn a huge monster. Alright, I guess that guy's just gonna sit back there until I figure this out. Matter. 
Alright, so let's get another housing project going. quick. We'll just keep building houses until someone makes an objection about the amount of jobs available. This should be the one where they want to stay, yeah, put two behind it. into how to big, make that any bigger, so I guess it's as big as we can get them for now or until I figure out a different approach. Put the two houses back here to see if they do anything. Interestingly, my, uh, my population isn't telling me my cap anymore. It's now just saying I've got 270. So, I mean, it's... it's it's growing quite rapidly now, but... We keep an eye, I guess, on this maintenance cost versus tax collected. I mean, people are, are pretty happy at the moment. Play around with some apartment buildings because we haven't had a look at them yet. So just stack. That was one of these guys, and that looked like one of these guys on top of that. Oh, that sense. Make four of those. Okay, so now we're we're out of jobs. So we'll just stack these guys up again. See if there's any. So what's that? Just one of the small guys on top. Do that to this guy too. So basically, we've just got to build the same thing again behind it to increase that. But as long as we don't have a demand for jobs anymore, we'll just keep building. So we'll go. Let's get the ambulance over here. ambulance fire engine over there. Let's just sort of see if we can just dump them on top of stuff. Hopefully that works. Good, it's getting put out. So we'll go one, two. I wonder if living in apartment buildings lowers the happiness of people or if Everyone's pretty happy to just be here. Another blueprint. Okay, so that looks like... Is that just four houses? So just four more houses on top. Population of 195 is, is quite nice for... Um, for our build, so maybe we should do another one of those. So let's try and uh, try and fit it in here. Put out four grid. Now the houses on top. We do have more money than sense in this level, really. Oh, what was that? Population density. I think, yeah. General happiness. Area quality. Taxes collected. So I was just pressing the uh, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4 on the keyboard. I'm curious how I brought those menus up. Okay. 
I assume all we got to do is just build another level on top, but uh, we don't need to do that right now. What we will do is try and improve the, the happiness of these two guys. So let's just actually swing back around here and we'll put flower bed just behind them. And these guys can have a flower bed just beside them. And then they need some jobs. So this guy in as tight as we can. So let's double that. So since these guys still want, want jobs, let's well, they now don't need to seem like they're happy now that we'll um keep working for them. This is a little bit forgivable in those those off angles. Again, just the other way. Okay, so we're up to 668. So let's put in some emergency services around um, these apartment buildings because assumably they're going to be pretty antsy. So it doesn't, I'm, I was surprised. I expected to just sort of demolish trees as I went uh, if I placed a house on top of it, but apparently you've got to. You've actually got to get rid of it because it doesn't look great. Okay, we've got our phosphate, we've got put our fire station in. I'll stick that back here. Because he'll, he'll be touching that one. Okay, so next up we want more apartments. Now we're doing quite well with our population here. We're up over 800. So hopefully just another apartment building can push us over the edge. Because I mean, we're up over 900 now. We are still on the grow. And everyone's relatively happy too, so it seems unlikely another apartment building is gonna, gonna drop us below that happiness level. Cool, so there's those ones complete. So what we can now do is go for our mayor's mansion. That is quite big. For the mayor, we'll spend us expense will put him right at the end of the street. Did that not work? Just on that edge there that it's not happy with it? Alright, well let's go for our second option next to a coal mine, uh, coal fire. Okay, so those ones are greyed out, so I guess this is the mayor's mansion that we're going for this time. Special building. Oh, another layer up. Very fancy. There we go. Another one down. Definitely uh, not throwing a challenge at us just yet, but still still enjoying our way, getting used to our, our sort of builds. I feel like once we get to a point where we sort of know our builds off the top of the head, we'll, uh, we'll start to really have some fun. Looks like the next one could be too, good too, because it looks like we're going to be starting with balancing. Um, but yeah, until then, I'll, um, I'll catch you later. See ya.